it is time for a Disney Parks haul. If you are familiar with my channel, if you watched any of my videos on the regular, you know that I do a lot of grocery hauls on this channel. But unlike those videos, there are no coupons, there are no buy one get one free deals at Disney World. It's just regular price. <laughs> but you know what? I'm willing to pay the prices because it's all so magical. However, I did want to mention that I found a clearance section in Epcot in the gift shop in Japan. There was one little corner shelf back in the back of the store that had some like little bowls and cute stuff marked down like 30% off. So there are deals to be found in Disney World, but I didn't buy any of them. So here's what I got. I'm going to start with things that I bought for myself and then I'll go on to the other things that I bought for other people. So the first thing I bought was a, well, most of I bought was mugs. So here's the first mug. I saw this one on someone else's Disney World haul and knew that I had to have it. It says, a dream is a wish your heart makes. And on the other side, it has a picture of Cinderella. She's my favorite princess. And the inside of the mug is it's really pretty, like periwinkle blue. And then the handle is blue as well. And it was $9.95. And I found this mug in um, Disney Springs at the World of Disney store. And I did not see um, that particular mug or the ones like that anywhere else in the park. They might have been there, but I just missed them. So if you're looking for that mug in particular, the best place to find it is Disney Springs. Okay, second thing I bought for myself was another mug. I got this mug in Epcot in England in the gift store. It has black and white and gray cats all over it. It's just so cute. And it is a fine bone china mug and it was made in England so it was a little more expensive it was $29.95 but I mean it's china can you hear that it's really nice quality it's really really pretty and we really loved our time in Epcot especially in England so I wanted to have something to commemorate the time that we had there and our favorite meal that we ate was in the restaurant in England that I will write a blog post about very soon so once that blog post has been written detailing what we ate and how much we loved it. I will link that for you in this video because it was a really, really good meal. Um, another thing that I knew I really wanted was an ornament. So I picked this one up. It is Mickey Mouse. There we go. You can see it has little like rhinestone diamondy things on it. It has a little um, string tag, ribbon tag, and it was $14.95. I got this in the Christmas store in Magic Kingdom, but there are Christmas ornaments all over the parks, Disney Springs. There are specific Christmas shops, especially Magic Kingdom, and I know that I saw at least one in Epcot as well. So I like this one because it's like a metal kind of material. It's not fragile, so if it falls off the tree or something happens to it, it shouldn't break at least for several years. So I was glad to have that. I also wanted to get some postcards to send to my friends and family, so I got this one, Cinderella's Castle, and then two of these, there we go, that are Cinderella's Castle with Main Street at night. I was obsessed with Cinderella's Castle while we were there. I just couldn't get enough of like staring at it and taking pictures of it. So I wanted some postcards. I think I might frame one of these actually for myself and then send the other two to my family. Um, and these were $1.95 in the gift shops and they had these everywhere. Even the gift shop at our resort, Magic Kingdom, Epcot, I saw these everywhere. So those are not hard to find. Okay, that's all I bought for myself. Yes. This is my husband, Paul's souvenir. This is an Avengers mug. Has all the guys on it. I don't actually know who these people are, but he thought it was cool. It's like a kind of a rectangle handle instead of a curved handle. And then on the inside of the mug, it says Avengers Assemble. And this one was $12.95. And we got this in Disney Springs at World of Disney. I did not see these mugs anywhere else necessarily. In Disney World um, they might have been there I just wasn't looking for them at that time so Disney Springs is really the best place to go if you're looking for specific non mouse Disney stuff so we had a good time spending our money in Disney Springs okay then I got this mug for my sister Allie who blogs for me at comehomeforcomfort.com this is the bell mug they had these for several different princesses and they're super cute so this is like her dress and it has the rose on it around and then also has the rose on the oops this side on the handle there and then on the inside of the mug it has her autograph which is really cute and this one was $19.95 and these were everywhere as well gift shops in our resort magic kingdom disney springs everywhere okay one more mug and then we'll be done with the mugs this 
is the Darth Vader mug from Star Wars. We had a hard time finding um, authentic, not authentic, original Star Wars stuff because the new movie's coming out. Everything we saw in the parks was all for the new movie instead of the original Star Wars. So we got this one again at Disney Springs in the World of Disney store. And it's a really, like, my face for size, like, it's a really big mug. It's really nice. And it was only $14.95. Um, and the back of it is just, like, the back of his helmet or face or whatever. I've never actually seen Star Wars, so I don't really know, but that's a gift for someone. Um, okay, this is for my mom. So, mom, if you're watching this video, please stop. Thank you. All right, um, this is an ornament, and it is Mary Poppins. She's a huge fan of Mary Poppins. And it even has, like, her, um, I don't know if you can see in the camera, but her umbrella, the end of it, is the little parrot, like it is in the movie. And this one was $19.95. They have these everywhere too. I got this one at Disney Springs, I'm pretty sure, but um, they had these everywhere. And they had tons of ornaments and some that were a little more expensive that were like $24 each, but you could get three for 60, so not a bad deal. A couple more things. Um, if you have golf lovers in your family, we've got this set of ball markers. So it has Mickey Mouse playing golf and then it has Donald Duck and Goofy that are interchangeable, like these are like magnetic. They come out and then those two fit in so you could have different ones if you wanted them. I guess that's how that works. I don't play golf, I don't really know what these are for. Um, and this was $19.95. This makes a really nice gift for someone who doesn't want like a Mickey Mouse t-shirt or something. And then we also picked up this same kind of thing. It's the ball marker, but it's the kind that you can clip onto your baseball hat or your visor or whatever. And then it, ha it just says Walt Disney World Golf and it has a picture of the castle with a golf ball in the front. And it, that, again, is magnetic. And these um, are interchangeable with these guys that we got as well. Random sticker. And this one was $12.95. So that makes a nice gift as well. One more thing. This, <laughs> this is the most random thing we got. This is an activity set. And it's Disney Junior. And it features Princess Sophia, who our two-year-old niece absolutely loves. So I got this for her, probably give this to her as a Christmas gift. This was $9.95, so it was a really good deal. It has 10 coloring pages, two sticker sheets, eight markers, and seven stencils. So you can see on the back, that's what's included. Cute stuff. So we had tons of fun shopping at Disney World. My husband is so generous with me, and <laughs> I could have come home with a ton more than I did. If I looked at something or touched it or looked at it for more than like one second, he'd say, do you want that? Did we get that for you? So... It was only by my sheer willpower that we did not come home with all of Disney World because it is very easy, easy to go into the Disney store in Disney Springs and need all the things. <laughs> so I'm really happy. It's my favorite thing that I came home with is my Cinderella mug because I have loved Cinderella all of my life and I got to meet her. The first, for the first thing we did in Disney World was meeting Cinderella and I have that in a blog post that I can link for you down below. It was really super fun. Um, so... This is my favorite souvenir from Disney World. Thank you so much for watching my haul. If you would like to comment down below and tell me um, your favorite Disney character, I would love to hear. Of course, mine is Cinderella. So, hope you all are having a great afternoon or morning or evening, whatever it is when you're watching this. And I hope that you'll subscribe to my channel. I have several more Disney videos coming up. So, be sure to check those. Look out for those. Check back for those. I don't know. I think I need a snack. All right. I'll talk to you guys later. Bye.